began. Before I began. We began before this moment. All that is holds us, birthed and carried. We must also hold. We must also carry. I see us in her and her in us.
Some of you uh, may know now that I am a dance, a dancer, a dance choreographer, uh, and I am dance, and so are you, and so are we all. Um, so, today's uh, performance, आप लोगों ने देखी. बुल्ला की जाना मैं कौन? And I think इसी precise question को सिर्फ मैं नहीं, हम सभी जो हैं question कर रहे हैं a different part of our life, a different path in uh, in and out of relationships, in everyday thinking, in everyday living, in everyday being. So the title of my talk is May I Dance With You Authentically. Right. So, when we want to talk to someone or want to connect with someone, so the, the point of conversation is that the immediate natural inclination that is to understand that person at a deeper level. Now, the depth, jo hai, it can't be measured or it can't be spoken through words. Sometimes the depth and the connection that we're longing for, that we're wanting, deserves and desires more depth. And I personally feel that words, which are like a bag, which we put in the ocean छोटे छोटे डब्बे भरकर और उनको हम पेश करते हैं लेकिन इमोशन इतना बड़ा एक समंदर है कि उस तक पहुंचने के लिए आपको नाचना ही पड़ता है <laughs> तो मेरा नाम एज आई सेड वहाब शाह है um, मैं पाकिस्तान पाकिस्तान में पैदा हुआ शहर डेरा इस्माइल खान उसके बाद हम बचपन में ऑस्ट्रेलिया शिफ्ट हो गए वहां पर मेरी सारी एजुकेशन हुई I took my contemporary dance training from there. I started my first dance company from there. And in 2006, we were in Australia. Just over 10 years. When I came to Pakistan, because my training was a contemporary dance form, I came here and I, was, I met this beautiful human being. Uh, who really made me understand the layers of, of who I am, the layers of spirituality. Miss Nigga Chaudhary, she's sitting amongst the audience right now. <laughs> she truly and utterly embraced me in all aspects. And I started understanding my own self at a spiritual level. And what was my training in Western uh, dance, ki, uske andar jo spirituality had to add spirituality, so I performed kiya at World Performing Arts Festival pe, and all the venues. So, today, people started to label me Wahab Shah Sufi Dancer. Wahab Shah Sufi Dancer, there were other labels. Some people said Wahab Silak. Some people said Siki, some people said Siki. Different, different names were given to me. And then finally, my identity became a Wahab Shah, a uh, Sufi dancer. The film industry was opening up. Uh, award ceremonies were happening. They were looking for newer, fresher ideas. I was studying from the West, dance, acting, technique. So uh, it was a right match. I started doing films. I started doing choreography for Lux style, Hum style, you name it. I've done it all. But was it? Was that really success? I don't know. There was still something missing. The Sufi dancer in me who was just dancing for himself, trying to please God and God knows whom, and somewhere in between, was searching for more. And in that quest and in that search, I started taking these voyages. I started travel That's where I met this amazing lady called uh, Yasmin Viteke Khan, who runs uh, um, an organization by the name of uh, Insan Culture Club. And she said to me, Ke, yaar, galiyon mein chalte let's go and, uh, and see what happens. Let's take the, the message of Baba Bulle Shah to the streets of London. We went there, normal, no expectations. We camera I a little bit. I presented 
it became viral. Three, four years ago, ki baat hai, the video went crazy viral all over the uh, all over the internet. Exploded. But was that really success? Not really. <laughs> Then a core video, jab maine apni uh, apni vocabulary ko enhance karne ke liye um, filmo me aur isme karne ke liye, I started learning different art forms. One art form in particular is the the ancient art form of mudra. To understand what it is, what it says, what it means, what are the nuances, and that video went viral, and I was called something else. Maybe I can't even say it to you guys, but if you guys Google it, you'll find out the kind of things that have been said. Just because how I looked, I was, I was a Sufi, I was a Sikh, I was somewhere in the middle, I did not belong to a single so-called gender divide. There were a lot of things that were thrown at me. But was that really success? I don't think so. So what is success? Let's talk about what is dance first. Dance ek ek aisa emotion hai, ek aisi baat hai, ek aisi cheez hai jo ke aap subha se leke raat tak sham se abhi is waqt bhi aap log baithe hue hain jis posture mein koi koi baitha hua hai, kisi ne haath rakhe hue hain, koi aise baitha hua hai to koi ye kar raha hai, to koi khuja raha hai, ye dance hai. Isi ko agar main apne gestures mein leke raha hu to I'll go one Two, three, four, whatever. We're dancing all the time. There was a video that I compiled, a little video. Unfortunately, we can't play it because we're short of time. But uske andar kuch imagery hai, jo ke nature me maujood hai. Dance hamare ird gird maujood hai. We are a product of dance. Baba Bulle Shah talks about dance. Rumi talks about dance. Everybody that we know is talking about dance. You're dancing, I am dancing. At what capacity, at what level? We are aware, yet we are not aware. So sometimes I think bringing that understanding of what is dancing, why is it dancing, and who is it dancing for? It just needs a little bit of your attention. And we will start appreciating that you were dancing from the day you were conceived. From the day you started coming onto this earth, you were born with this inherent feel of dance. The pulse, the, the, the little rhythms that are dancing all around you. You're dancing, I'm dancing, we're dancing. When we go out, as I mentioned earlier, जब हम कहीं पे जाते हैं किसी से मिलने के लिए अंग्रेजी में एक कहा जाता है कि मैं हैव टू डांस विद यू व्हाई इज दैट व्हाई आर्ट वर्ड्स इनफ टू कन्विंस द पर्सन बिकॉज़ यू वांट टू गेट टू नो दैट पर्सन एट दैट डीपर लेवल एंड डांस कनेक्ट्स यू एट दैट डीपर लेवल इट टेक्स योर minds your folds into a a sea of emotions jo cheeze main words mein bayan nahi kar sakta i am by nature i think i'm an introvert but i am right now being an extrovert but my extrovert comes out truly when i'm moving when i'm in the moment when i'm dancing as a matter of fact even right now my gestures my feelings are dancing and you can see it now in terms of how the journey is being going on and what dance is saying to us all um it is just telling us to be more open to be more um alive to understand that when the wind blows the trees are swaying when the birds are flying they are flying away when the sea is flowing it is flowing when the wind is blowing it is blowing so when you start seeing things when you start seeing things in motion you'll fall in love not with dance but with yourself and that's all that's what we all want to do is fall in love with ourselves all over again every single moment and 
We look at motivational speakers, you come to TED Talks, you Google, you research. For whom? Apni satisfaction ke liye, apne liye. Aap kisi aur ke liye kuch nahi karte. Hum sab apne liye, apni zaat ke liye, apne aap ko samajne ke liye, apne creator se milne ke liye, rozana research karte hain. Rozana tayar ho ke nikalte hain. Rozana khojte hain. Rozana sad hote hain. Rozana happy hote hain. And I personally feel the kind of connection it gives me, the kind of high that it gives me, the kind of एक जो transparent naked आमना सामना है between you and your creator happens for me, for my soul, which is which is not defined by gender. My soul is genderless. When it meets, when it meets the the creator. It becomes one. And in that moment, something happens. And that something that is happening, that beautiful connection that we are supposed to share or we are sharing, becomes poetry in motion for the audience. And that they get pulled in to that moment. But you can have that moment too. If you start embracing and start letting yourself go. Okay, so I guess uh, I think we don't have too much time because I know we have to keep it really precise. We can go on and on. Um, where I stand right now, as I said, I've been uh, I've been given a lot of labels, and I embrace every single one of them because I don't believe in labels. Hence, anything that is given to me, I feel like, oh, amazing! Please give it to me. Oh, please give it to me. Please give it to me. So for me, what is next is honestly. I don't know what is next, but what I know what is next is for me to explore more, to be boundaryless, to be genderless, to be anything less, so that I have the capacity to be more. And and on that journey, on that journey, I am uh, planning on. Moving physically wherever I can be, um, having less so that I can acquire more, dancing more, speaking more, understanding more, and in that process, just representing who I am, where I'm from, because my DNA, my social, economical being, the the identity, the Pakistanianness, the subcontinent being becomes truly me when i'm at when i'm at that journey when i'm at that voyage when i'm performing when i'm dancing if any of you end up seeing any pakistani representing their work abroad you ought to be end up saying yaar ye pakistani hai na hamara apna hai <laughs> so is apne ness ko explore karne ke liye main apne aap ko kuch aise comfortable zone mein se nikal ke uncomfortable zones mein dalna chahta hu just to see myself more and thank you so much <laughs> thank you to each and every one of you who has actually come in and has been part of this journey for me because i think it hadn't been for you i don't think this would have existed this would have existed so you exist so we both complete each other thank you for completing <laughs> and thank you for being that journey with me so isi note ke sath खुदा हाफिज कहता हूँ आप लोगों से किसी और स्टेज मुलाकात होगी बहुत बहुत शुक्रिया